Hey everybody, my name is Amy Caroline and I'm about to go find one of our developers, Arnaud, to talk about the sales application. So let's go. Oh hey Arnaud! Oh, I just went to Gramachi. Do you want to talk uh, uh, outside? Yeah, let's go! Yeah. Thanks for uh, meeting with me. Yeah, it was a pleasure. So I was just wondering a little bit about the sales application. Uh, what's going on? What has changed from version 13 to version 14? Oh, uh, as we know, sales application is quite an old and established application. Uh, I think it was one of the first. So um, there is no big apocalypse this year. Mm -hmm. uh, it's more uh, more little details. and. Um, you know, all the, the, the changes that w we see in uh, overall audio, uh, they will be seen in the cell application, like the, the colors, the, the, the tags, the sample data, etc. But there is no big changes and big crunch in the cell application this year. So it'll still be the same sales app that our users yeah. have come to know and love, um, but slightly improved. <laughs> yeah, the, 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 the flow will be the same. Uh, it's just a little bit uh, better in every single detail. <laughs> okay, and you can can you tell me about something in particular that has improved? Yeah, yeah. Um, we had this um, request from the community because sometimes when you use the uh, quotation template, mm -hmm. the problem is that when you sell in uh, all over the world, you 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 set some translation um, on your quotation template, but before it wasn't. Um, used once you 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 had the actual mm -hmm. uh, sell order and it was a little bit painful so now it's fixed and uh, you, you can sell all over the world and have one uh, uh, quotation template and it will be um, used for, for all your, your clients uh, whenever the whatever the, their language right so this will definitely improve the usability of yeah the sales exactly application especially for those who sell internationally yeah, yeah. or um, even nationally with different languages. In Belgium, we have three national exactly, languages. Exactly, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's really cool. And did you enjoy working on this feature in particular? Yeah, exactly, because, um, you know, uh, translation, it's a, a technical field, and I didn't know how to uh, it was used inside Odoo before the, this, um, this task. And so I learned a lot dr uh, doing it, and it's, yeah, it was, quite pleasant to to understand the uh, right. you know the, the gears inside Odoo how everything in, is managed and right. interacting all these little bricks <laughs> and you mentioned that this uh, was a feedback from the community so our users saw that there was a need for improvement there yeah. and we listened to them and we did it how does it feel being able to directly respond to their needs yeah it, it's really great to uh, a nice sensation because you see, you, you you have this request, and I think it was a, a partner. Mm -hmm. uh, th they had this problem for the, the client. So they, they made an issue on the, our GitHub account. And then uh, we saw it, and then it was transformed into an internal task. Mm -hmm. And then it's ready, it's in the wild <laughs> for everybody. That's, a, that's really great to, to, to work on um, with um, a software with mm -hmm. such a nice community and uh, to see that when everything you do can improve the life of people from all over the world and right. uh, and it's yeah. cool seeing that it's really, a, in a way, a group effort. We work with the community to figure out what we need to improve as well as we have ideas of our own. I assume that's the same yeah, in the, exactly. with the sales um, team as well, that you not only listen to the community, but maybe you guys have your own ideas internally on how to uh, improve and you work, of course, closely with the product owner. And what did you find something about this implementation or working on another feature uh, that was particularly tricky or complicated or um not speak, not in sales like like i said there is no big technical change uh, inside the mm -hmm. core on the other apps yes because we are moving mm -hmm. from uh, one app to, to another uh, not just st stuck on sales but sales th there are no 
I feel no no big changes that, that will uh, right. uh, mentally uh, <laughs> difficult <laughs> stuff. But it's still good for the user. They'll definitely see some new yeah, colors, as you exactly. said, and there are still some things just to make the flow a lot easier. And you mentioned sample data as well, which I suppose will just make it a lot easier for the user to really imagine uh, what their business could look like. Yeah, because most of the time when they, they come to, to a, uh, an empty database, it's just it, it's normal it's it's empty but uh, s people you you know when you enter a clean room and you don't want to move any <laughs> <laughs> any things and then you you see how, how it will be and, ah, that's nice uh, i will i will just uh, make a new cell order and, and it's normal it will look like it and uh, and with this color with these steps and it's it's really oh, good okay. because what is really uh, great with audio is that uh, you don't have to be uh, a specialist to use it. Mm -hmm. Everybody can access it and uh, make it uh, to, to, to their needs. And uh, yeah, it, that just one step further to that direction. Well, thank you so much for taking some time to uh, have your break with me and to chat <laughs> with me about sales. <laughs> That was pleasure. It's nice. <laughs> it's still hot, so I don't know. <laughs> <laughs>